Hi everyone, welcome back to Do So Sweets. Today is Columbia's Independence Day, which basically means the 4th of July, just the 20th. So, 20th of July. Sounds a little different, but. <laughs> <laughs> Today we are going to be making a uh, galleta de limon, which is a traditional Colombian lemon cookie lime cookie <laughs> that they have on the coast. Our dad is from uh, Colombia and they just have these on the coast. They're very traditional. They're really good too. Yeah, so vamanos, let's go. Let's go. So the things that you'll need for the cookies will be four cups of flour, two and a half sticks of butter, one and a half cups of sugar, uh, one and a half teaspoons of baking soda, one teaspoon of baking powder, one cup of milk, one egg, and two limes worth of lime zest. So the first thing that you're gonna do is whisk together your dry ingredients. Does that include the sugar? Yes. So now that the dry mixture is combined, we are going to make a hole in the center of the flour mixture. So now we're going to add the butter and the egg into the well that we have made. Well? Hole. So we cut the butter into cubes and room temperature so it's easier to do. We are going to mix this with a spoon first and then with our hands. So it's going to get a little messy. So we put that in the well and now we are going to hole, hole that we made with the flour mixture. And now we're going to mix it with a spoon um, just so it's all combined. Then we'll go in later with our hands. Okay, it's not going to be like a dough quite just yet because we're going to add the milk in later so it should just be a bunch of crumbs. So now that we've gone in with the spoon and got all the butter coated in flour, Sophia is going to go in with her hands and get a little messy and mix the butter and flour mixture together. Um, yeah, we're just going to mix that together and then we're going to gradually add the milk after she's done mixing that. And you'll know when your dough is ready, when no more flour and butter get stuck to your hands. And you're gonna do it for 10 minutes, so you'll know when it's ready. So we are going to slowly add the milk. Fun fact about Columbia, um, they love soccer. As you can tell, we're wearing our soccer jerseys today. Sophia's the newer one. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, they even like call in to work and say, like, give an excuse to stay at home and watch soccer games. They love soccer so much. It's <laughs> amazing. <sighs> so you're gonna need that for 10 minutes. So we cheated and asked our mom to do it because Sophia's arms were getting tired, and I was getting very impatient. So now we're just drinking some lemonade. It's hard. Ten yeah. minutes is a long time. It, ten minutes is a long time. The mm -hmm. cookies, they smell like lemon biscuits. Oh, it smells so good. I wish the camera, like you could like smell through the camera. Yeah. That would be cool. So the dough has been kneaded. It took a while, probably like 20 minutes. Um, it took us longer because we're Americans. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to rest the dough for 20 minutes um, after it's kneaded and then we're going to pat it out and then we're going to cut it out with cups. You could also use a cookie cutter, but we're going to use cups. So. <laughs> now we're just going to pat it out. Uh, you could also do it with a rolling pin, but if you do it with a rolling pin, the dough will kind of like crack and not be as flat as you want it. And then we are going to cut it out with some cups. 
So a great technique is putting flour on the rim of the cup so you'll get a cleaner cut. And when you cut, just make sure your circles are nice and close to each other so you can get as many cookies um, out of one. So we put flour on our pans and put the cookies on. We are going to put, traditionally in Colombia, they do it, they cook th these cookies um, on the stove, a uh, wood fire, um, but we're gonna do mostly in the oven, some in the oven and then some on the stove. And we're gonna see which one turn, yeah, turns out better. Um, for the oven, we're going to preheat it to 390 degrees for, and then we're going to bake it for 15 minutes. And for the stove, we're just going to eyeball it to see like if they turn brown, because I don't know. <laughs> I also made one for our little sister. One because we had extra dough and one because we have a little sister. Okay. All right. Let's see what happens. You do oven, I do stove. So these are how the cookies turned out. The traditional Colombian cookie looks mm -hmm. like this. this. On These are the ones that you did on the stove top. So you want it on low heat, low. This is low, this is medium. <laughs> yeah, this these are black because you did it on medium. So low heat for about 15 minutes for the stove top and when you bake the cookies, 15 minutes at like 390. These are how the Colombian traditional cookies look, and these are how they look baked. See you next time. Bye. Bye.